Living on Fox 14 continues. And welcome back. I'm joined now by Daniel Tolbert with the Northeast Louisiana Arts Council here to talk about the screening of the Five Awake and the panel on domestic violence that will follow. Thank you, Danielle, so much for joining us. Thanks for having me. When is the screening of Five Awake? Five Awake will be screened next Wednesday, July 18th at 7.30 at the Flying Tiger Brewery. And tell us what it's about. So Five Awake is a Louisiana-made and Louisiana-directed film. Mm -hmm. um, it's about five women who are fed up with domestic violence, and they've pushed through through historic uh, measures through the Louisiana legislature regarding domestic violence. Are the women from here? The women from all over. Um, there's a few from Baton Rouge and New Orleans, and we're really excited that the director, Donna Dees, will be joining us next week. And what will the panel be about after the screening? The panel will feature the director, Donna Dees, and she'll be talking about the filmmaking process. And we'll also have representatives from the Wellspring there to talk about their services regarding domestic violence and what battered women can do. And have you seen the screening? I have. I watched it last week. It's tell really powerful. The, tell, tell us about the, that, it being powerful and the message that it sends out. It's really powerful. It really ta shares the story of five different women who have connections to, through domestic violence, either from themselves or a sister or a friend. Um, and they're fed up. They're angry and they want to stop. And uh, they put teeth uh, in the legislature uh, to pass these bills to protect more women. And this is one of uh, four other screenings that will be taking place at Flying, Flying Tiger? Yes, so July 18th is Five Awake, and then in August we will be screening I Am the Blues, a film about the Mississippi and Louisiana blues, mm -hmm. and then we'll be rescreening Heart of a Tiger in September, which is a story about one of the original Flying Tigers. And we are very close to the Flying Tigers, of yes. course, being here in Northeast Louisiana with Chenault Aviation Museum, and uh, we're really lucky to have these type of screenings here locally. We really are and Louisiana has such powerful stories and the Arts Council is really thankful to share those. Is there a cost to go to the screening? Arts Council members can uh, enter for free um, and if you're not an Arts Council member it's just five dollars and the proceeds from the tickets will be split between the Arts Council and the Wellspring. What's the purpose of the Arts Council? Um, the Arts Council purpose is to uh, nourish a vibrant regional arts culture through support promotion and education. And this is uh, one of five screenings that will be taking place at Flying Tide and uh, I was there actually yesterday for the uh, youth professionals mm -hmm. and our young profession, uh, young business professionals. And they mentioned that there, were, there will all also be food trucks. Yes. So we have food trucks every every time out there. Really delicious food. So it's really great that you can support a local business like Flying Tiger by purchasing a pint, supporting a local business by purchasing some food from a food truck, and then just sharing with the Arts Council and the Wellspring um, and helping out those services that make Northeast Louisiana better. Will there be a question and answer session with the panel? Yes, so the panel will be open. Uh, we'll have uh, prepared questions, but we'll also take questions from the crowd as well. And who's invited to attend? Everyone who's 21 and up can attend. Just make sure you bring your ID, and we look forward to seeing you. Okay, and let's go back over the screening, the first one, uh, what, the time that it's going to take place. So the Arts Council will be screening Five Awake, July 18th at 7.30 at the Flying Tiger Brewery. And what does Five Awake, the title, uh, how did they come up with that name? Um, the title Five Awake is about the five women uh, who are featured in, in the story. So you have a uh, legislature, you have um, a director of United Way, and you have uh, just an everyday woman off the street who who's absolutely angry at the situation uh, that one of her friends was put in. A wake up call. Thank you so much, Danielle, for Thank joining you. Thank you. And coming up next, it details on planning a surprise family play day. You're watching Louisiana Living on Fox 14.